It was so cold this morning, I saw a snowman trying to build a fire to stay warm on the way to work. Just like water in the ocean, more or less, this stronger wave is going to come in and actually displace this one a little bit more. It's been 52 days since any decent, measurable rain has fallen in Garden City. Game, but I bet that's a good luck charm. That wacky squirrel is so <laughs> wacky. For tomorrow as well, so keep that in mind. As wayward turkeys running all over the place around here. I did say beautiful Halloween evening. We can see temperatures primarily in the 40s in the northwest part of the state. Yeah, yeah, those receipts. Oh, right, sir. Bad tie? No, I like my reindeer tie. <laughs> should have seen the sweater he had on last night. Now that's really a different ugly. story. And speaking of dressing appropriately, some local preschoolers got the chance to take a pretend trip to the store and buy some gifts just for them. It's a yearly event for the kids in Wichita's Head Start program. On board the train. Boy, you do have to be a diehard for that. There's the Elvis in person. Oh, you, I think you need more of a quaff. Thank you. Thank you very much. A little more thicker hair on top. We're going to see you tomorrow. Right. <laughs> He's not quitting. Good night, everyone. We'll see you Come tomorrow. On, hey. <laughs>
So this is what I'm talking about. The core of the cold comes in on Monday, high temperature of 35, but I think we get back on a return flow by Tuesday and Wednesday. So temperatures jump right back up 45 Tuesday, 50 on Wednesday, hey, 56 by next okay. Thursday. That's not bad. 45 though by Friday of next week in North Central Kansas, 34 for a high on Monday. Yes, it's going to be cold, but we tack on about 10 more degrees for Tuesday. A few more for Wednesday. You're back to the 50s on Thursday. Now in Southwest Kansas, this is what I mean. The heart of the cold air, I think, will stay north and northeast. So 44 for a high on Monday, not as cold as parts of central Kansas. Then you're back to the 50s sooner on Tuesday and Wednesday. Same thing for northwest Kansas. 40s on Sunday and Monday. 50s return Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Maybe a, slow, a small dip in temperature there mm -hmm. by next Friday. But tomorrow we keep the heat and lose the wind. Tomorrow is a perfect day to do almost anything outside, so no excuses. All right. Thanks, J.D. Yeah. Up next, the latest. Changing. Cold today, not so much tomorrow. Meteorologist J.D. Rudds in the Pinpoint Weather Center. J.D. Hey there, John. Yeah, tomorrow will be a much warlmer day for us. Touching back on what's going on at the slick spots, let me kind of give you some perspective here what's happening. Nothing's actually falling from the sky, but look at the temperature, which is 24 in Wichita and the dew point, 23. Very close together, 96% relative humidity. So you've got a saturated atmosphere in our hands, and obviously that temperature is well below freezing. That is what's causing those slick spots, primarily on elevated roadways, on and off ramps and perhaps some sidewalks. So be careful tonight and into early tomorrow morning. What a difference it was from yesterday to today. Almost 30 degrees cooler in many areas today versus yesterday. Tomorrow we go the opposite direction. Here it is by the hour. Highs tomorrow in the 50s. Wait until you see the weekend forecast. It's coming up. What we hope will be a turning point in our temperatures. J.D. Rudd is here to explain in our first forecast. Hey, J.D. Stephanie, you didn't feel that change <laughs> earlier today. It was actually about three degrees warmer this afternoon than yesterday. I know not very much at all, but tomorrow we're talking about a 15 to 20 degree change. So many will feel that one. Live look outside right now with our Cox Metro Cam. Current conditions that we have across Wichita. It's cold, 19 degrees. Southwest wind at 5, so the wind chill is down to 12. And it will be cold again tomorrow morning. The lows that we had this morning, many of us in the mid to low teens, even a single digit reading in Hutch. Tomorrow morning again, we start the day out in the teens, but look at that nice turnaround. 50 by 3 o'clock. It gets even better by Friday, but then we got to talk about the weekend. That's coming up here in just a few minutes. We head into the weekend. J.D. Rudd has details in our first forecast. Hi there. Hey there, Stephanie. Great day for us across the state today. A little bit on the windy side. Tomorrow we'll do away with the wind, but keep the nice temperatures. Let me take you through and see how things went today. We started the morning out around 10 o'clock or so in the 40s and the 30s, but quickly afternoon, boy, did things warm up nicely. The numbers were well into the 50s across most areas at 1 o'clock and then the high temperatures were in the 60s in some parts of Kansas. Then, of course, the sun went down and we cooled quite a bit. Temperatures a couple of hours ago were back down mainly in the 40s across the state. We'll take a live look outside in Wichita right now. Current temperature reading is 47 degrees. Still have those south winds at around 15 miles an hour, so it feels more like 41. But tomorrow we lose the wind. We keep the sun and the warm temperatures. Highs tomorrow, 50s and 60s. But some change coming on Sunday and even bigger change for Monday. More on that in just a few minutes.